We got, a, we got the box coming out from uh, Rezo. So we're gonna end up getting Fox. Uh, we're gonna end up getting uh, some Fox Rob here. I wonder how uh, one of the the, the um the bot is behind Fox or uh, on Ravens here. I'm these, not really sure. These two tend to play a lot, so Maybe, probably some yeah. reason behind. There's probably some. There's probably some uh, player meta, you know. Playing the play into the uh, player meta. Looks like it's working so far. <laughs> it's working really well. Yeah. razo has got 105 percent on uh, Hatter RJ. That's basically well, not basically an answer. I shouldn't say that. Is that a uh, 39? Wolf Rob isn't very good for. Okay, more, more you know. That back here is gonna take it. It looks very tough for Rob to deal with. Um, all this pressure coming out from uh, Razo is really just dishing out the percent, and then you know having a big body like Rob survive for against Fox at 120 is gonna be pretty difficult. It kind of holds up with how the match is going right now. In, in a match like this, that big body is a huge liability. Um, you're just gonna get up tilted, you're gonna get hit by everything and the kitchen sink, but Rob's gonna hit you with everything and the refrigerator on top of that. So yeah, you the refrigerator is the gyro. There's plenty of there's plenty of refrigerators in this match. <laughs> there's a lot of fridges. It's like a professional kitchen in here. Uh anyway, we're gonna get the Nair up smash, not quite killing. Um had our RJ just kinda living a little bit longer than I would have expected. Especially on this stage with its uh, lower ceiling than usual. Unfortunately, now you're at 136 against uh, Fox. And Fox is at 89. You gotta make something happen here. And something is definitely happening. Something's brewing in D&Ds right now. <laughs> that was a beautiful narrative. Wow, a beautiful tech, tech follow-up. Unfortunately, uh, you can't kill Rob by hitting him off stage. So that happen. Oh, but there he comes out the outsmash. So now we're up two stocks. Up two stocks. Hatter's getting a little bit rock and rolled right now. Have no faith in the down throw. Good uh, timing on that downer. Even though the uh, even though Razo really mixed up that timing with the uh, upbeat, as well as the, uh, the, the positioning for the upbeat in the back of the stage. Right. Uh, Adder still managing to take the stop. What I, I really really like what Razo did there, uh, refusing to go for like the second up tilt, even though I'm pretty sure uh, he could have done it for free. Um, just trying to get that a uh, little bit of extra setup. damage when they do an air dodge and they're able to grab them, right? And it worked out. We got like 80%. The whole sequence went down and I think Rob got taken from like 40 to 100. And just like that, he whiffs the, uh, the, what is that, Nair up smash? And then up smash out of shield, frame 8 option. Gonna connect. Kills it, what, what was that, 130? I think it was 130. What? 130. Way too early. For a frame made out of shield option. That's Fox for you. That is Fox for you. But he's mid tier. Mid tier. But he's mid tier. Guys. Mid tier. I've got a real mid tier here. Going to uh, Town and City. Everybody loves Town and City. This is everybody's favorite big flat stage. Uh, FD notwithstanding. Seems like little, uh, I thought these um, combos coming out with all these combos coming out from Rezo. Um, with all these up airs, I should say. Um, Rob getting taken super high is going to be rough. Let's see if Town supports Rob and not getting hit by all these things. I like how Rezo opened up with the the classic uh, quick play Fox strat of just, I'm going to throw some lasers, get a bit of that free damage when you're targeting the gyro. Might as well. Might as well. It, it works just out. 3%. Going super deep off stage to try and get that edge guard with Fox, and uh, Rezo makes it back. That would have been terrifying. That would have been scared out of my mind going against Rob off stage that far. I would have too. Getting a little bit of everything there. Got the laser. I'm just, is that the movie with like the burner hit from the eyes as well? Oh, the uh, the, the uncharged laser. Yeah, the really, really close hit box. There's, uh, there's the upstack of the shield taking that first stock. <laughs> just, just walking around waiting for a Razor to come down. This reflector um, that Fox has is also going to be incredibly annoying. Rob really can't just, you know, send out his child and come out full down the neutral. Uh, Hatter really has to make things happen in order for that, that gyro to come into play, and it looks like Razo is just not giving him the chance to do anything. Yeah, they're just kind of... Again, super deep, and not getting any... Not getting any punished for it. Right, yeah, and they're, they're back here off stage. Razo seems... Off. not Razo. Uh, Hatter seems a little bit shaken up here. Um, they're not... They're lost. Yeah, they're not playing as well as they usually would, and that's a stock of back air, but back enough. kill. I think there was some sus DI on Razor A little suspect. Had a dare coming out uh, here. 
quick percentage. Hattered going high, doing the, uh, the snake recovery thing, but with Rob this time around. Down tilt, we got the Nair, we got the side B, but it does not connect. Um, just kind of not really edge guarding, not really going for anything big here. Um, oh, that was a good up air. Going for a bit of a juggle, it does not work out. Rezo uh, gets the Nair, another Nair, still going. Oh, forward air. Oh, he catches him anyway. Grab. What a great catch. And that up, yeah, that up air is going to take it. Um, Rezo takes it, what is that, 2-0? I didn't see it over uh, Havix. Yeah, the game was so quick. Yeah. It was super fast. That just looked really clean from Rezo. I, I really... Something's going on out there. Wow, the crowd is loud and proud outside. Holy cow. So next up, we're probably going to have... Here's the ball the way in here. Um, uh, maybe Marshall versus Plague, Plague Two, Plague Two. There's two of them. Plague is one of them. Plague Two and Plague Two. The existence of Plague One. That is true. And also Plague Three. And Plague underscore. This is true. <laughs> then we also have a uh, Broadway waiting in. What is this? 